how shall we that are dead to sin live any longer therein? You know, and I, I preached this sermon tonight because we've been through a tough group of weeks. We've been, we've been, we've, we've been discouraged. We fought the battle of the Pope, of all fundamental Baptists, it seems. Yep. Jack Scott in Hammond, Indiana, at Piles Anderson College. Yep. We, fought, we fought that stuff. We battled that for months, weeks on end. And it gets down to the end of it, and it just all explodes. And one night, you have so-called preachers, so-called men of God. God. People are supposed to be shepherding the flock of God. People that the Holy Spirit has set over Christians to try to lead them in this life, in this old sinful world, calling them names, calling them wicked, deriding them, calling them dumb and stupid and moronic. And what's another one? I don't know. It doesn't matter. If anybody asks me why we left Bible Baptist Church, I look at them and say, is it ever right for a preacher to call a man in their church or a woman in their church an idiot? No. And they're like, okay, well, that makes sense. You know? <laughs> but we've got these people who've done this to us. I mean, heretic Papa of Independent Baptist, Jack Scott, these churches just bowing the knee to that heretic, yeah, that's right. and Satan, and, and him and his... Jack Scott, the jockstrap himself, yep. you take right. out the mantle of Elijah is what it's supposed to say in the Old Testament. You're supposed to look, get me under the great men, as Jeremiah said. That's Good. getting under great men of Jesus Christ. Amen. That's getting under great men Good. of Paul. It's getting the great men of John and the other Amen. John. The men in the Bible getting under great men of Pastor Stephen L. Anderson. Good. Getting under Amen. great men of Pastor Jack Piles of Hammond, Indiana. All these great men that we can look to and listen to their preaching. I'm lazy. I would get me under the great men. That's what we're supposed to do. That's where we're supposed to go in this direction. But you've got these heretics, these, these preachers who are supposed to be doing something for God and are supposed to be lording over the flock and doing something right and leading them in the right direction. Call them idiots. You dumb old sheep. You can't do nothing right. You've only been saved five months or five Come on. years. Come on. Come on. Come on. Just bowing the knee to that heretic in Hammond, Indiana. Double went down to Hammond looking for a college to steal. That's right. <laughs> he stole it good. He took a lot of people. Oh, oh foolish. Oh, foolish Hammond. Who hath the wish to? He should not obey the truth before his eyes. Jesus Christ hath been evidently set forth, crucified among you. It's good. Amen. Quoted from Galatians 3, 1 and 2, or I think, something like that. It's good, right? Jack Scott, the jockstrap. Yep. <laughs> Taking up this mantle. You're supposed to take up the mantle of Elijah, not the jockstrap of Jack Scott. It's good. Right. Not the jockstrap of, I'm sorry, God, I want to be saved. Come on. Come on. Bow the knee in front of Jack Scott, jockstrap, the man himself. Put your hand on my Bible, he says at the end of that sermon, for Christ's sake. Sick. That's right. Wicked. Hey, I right. a big sermon if I ever heard one. That's right. Unbelievable. Just tell God that you're sorry. You don't have to believe it. Just tell him you're sorry. You'll be saved. Come on. For Christ's sake, he'll save you. The jockstrap. The jockstrap of Alexandrian Philistine doctrines of the Bible. Yep. yep. Good. Saying it's a dead old book. The Bible says, for as the body without the spirit is dead, so faith without works is dead. Hey, that page, those books, the, the Bibles across this room, those letter covers. The Spirit isn't in that. It's just a dead old book. Try again. And that's yeah. what they're teaching. They're taking out the inspiration yep. of God upon these words. Yeah. Come on. And it's just a dead book. They're a bunch of Alexandrians. Yep. They're a bunch of liberals. They're a bunch of limperists. They're a bunch of heretics. Yep. Yeah. They're a bunch of idol worshippers. That's right. They are. Yeah. There's more than one Bible. There's more than one word. There's more than one words of God. You've got more than one God. Because sure. in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. A bunch of Balaamite, wicked... Watered down. Come on. Come on, preach it. I can't think of any more words, but put them in there if you can come up with them. <laughs> the jock strap of. What else What else does he teach? Oh, marriage divine intimacy. The jock strap of that. The Jack Scott jock strap. 